Stella has been monitoring those conditions in Flagstaff since yesterday afternoon, and there she is joining us live this morning. Stella, it, it's a tough morning out there. Yeah, it's a pretty miserable morning, and that's because the wind gusts are just creating terrible driving conditions. The plow video that we showed you, those are actually city plows, so ADOT crews will be, of course, handling those highways and interstates, just so we're clear on that. So I don't know whose car this is, and I don't know how long it's been parked here, but I can tell you is we have not st seen the snow stop falling. I've been up since 2.15 this morning. Let's take a look at how much accumulation is on this car, probably two, maybe even three inches. So Flagstaff folks and anybody else who live in the high country will certainly have a lot of work. Oh my gosh, I'm not even using the right way this way. There you go, there's the brush. I also have my snow shovel here just to kind of show you what other work that high country folks are gonna be dealing with. Take a look at that, all of that accumulation. And that's probably what, 10 feet that I've walked. We're gonna to continue to walk through this parking lot area. So as I mentioned, we're by historic route 66. Yesterday afternoon, we were able to talk with the National Weather Service based here in Flagstaff. And I want you guys to take a listen to what they told me yesterday. For Flagstaff area at least. So we had this fourth snowiest January and February combined since our entire period of record, which goes back to 1898. Fourth snowiest on record in Flagstaff, and we are expecting another one to two feet of snow. Back out live here on the streets, I want you guys to take a look at how historic Route 66 is looking. We have seen a number of those city plows working to clear up the roadways. We've also seen those uh, sidewalk plows as well, trying to clear up all the fresh powder that we're getting, but it's the horrible wind gusts. I mean, it is making it very difficult to just walk around. Yes, it's a snow day for some students who have gotten their classes canceled, but it's not really a fun snow day because of just how strong the winds are whipping. Uh, you can see even with the plows working, the road conditions are absolutely terrible. That's because the snowfall rates are going probably an inch per hour if they're expecting anywhere from a foot to two feet of snow possible. So you definitely want to take things slow. You can see the snow plow working right now. They're probably just laying down uh, some of that de-icer uh, and cinder on the streets. But yeah, if you do need to travel, if you do need to drive on the roads, you want to stay updated on ADOT to make sure that the highway that you want to get on or the interstate you want to get on still remains open. But yeah, the wind is horrible. We have not seen that snow stop falling since 2.15 this morning. So uh, you definitely need to give yourself extra time if you're waking up and joining us from the high country because you got a lot of work on your hands. We're live here in Flag. I'm sending back to you guys.